Hi everybody, this is Valentina Gonzalez and I'm here with you today to share a platform with you called Talking Points and it is a fabulous way to connect with ELL families. I learned about Talking Points through a Facebook group called Advocating for ELLs and someone in the group asked a question to all of us um, about venues for communicating with ELL families when there's a language barrier. So um, translation apps, um, ways to communicate with families that speak various languages. And another member told us about talking points. So I thought I would research it, try it out and see how it works. And I loved it. And so when I find something that I really love, I can't help but share it with everybody because I want everyone to benefit from it, especially our ELL families. Um, what I love, one of the things I love about Talking Points is that it can translate messages that we send in English to various languages. And we can connect with our ELL families that we normally can't connect with. So, for example, if I want to share with my families that next week we're having picture day, and so here's here are some uh maybe some ways you can, some clothing you might want to wear for picture day. Or if I want to tell them that next month we're going on a field trip to the zoo and you need to send in money and we're going to ride the bus, then I can communicate that to my ELL families. Or if I, if I want them to come in for a parent-teacher conference, a face-to-face, -face, I can communicate through Talking Points. Talking Points is an app and it's also a web platform. So I'm gonna share with you um, how to use Talking Points step by step. Used to be that we had a language barrier, no more with Talking Points. It can translate into more than 20 languages. And I looked at the list. Really, these are like the top languages in our nation and in Texas. So I live in Texas, so that's relevant to me. And I know that, in, you know, when you look at the list, you're going to see that these are the top languages. I don't work for talking points. I'm just an advocate for ELLs. So if I find something that's fabulous for our ELL families, then I'm going to want to share it with everybody. Um, the, the platform also says that they're continuously adding more languages. So that's fabulous. So how do you use it? Step one, you go to your computer or you can also use your phone and um, you go to Talking Points or you download the app and you start adding your class list. You create a contact list. Who are the families you're going to want to con contact? Um, it's really easy. So uh, if you like using the computer better, you can or you can use your phone. Either way, as the educator, you can choose which one. And then you start sending messages. You can either send to individual families or you can send to a whole group all at once. Uh, if you want to, you know, tell an individual family about the progress of their child, uh, then you'd send just an individual lesson. But if you want to tell a whole group that, hey, next week we have an author coming and you're going to have an opportunity to buy this book, so you might want to bring a check or cash, then you might, you know, send to a list of, of contacts. You're going to send your message in English and the app will automatically translate it into their native language and they will not see your phone number. So don't worry, don't think, oh no, I don't want to use my phone because I don't want them to see my phone number. It's an app, so it's not going to share your phone number with the recipients. When families receive their message, they're going to see it in their native language and then they can respond back in their native language and you will receive it in English because the app translates it back to you. Isn't that amazing? It's magical. I love it. Um, now, if families want to respond back in English, that works too. I tried it out. And by the way, I tried it out with several of my family members and friends that speak different languages. It is not perfect. I'm not saying that it's perfect, but it is a step in the right direction so that we're communicating with our families. Uh, 
you know, connecting with our EL families is so important, getting them involved and engaged. And this is a step forward. Uh, nothing beats that face-to-face -face communication, bringing them in for conferences, um, going to their house for um, home visits. If your district or campus does that, I applaud you. I used to have a teacher who did that when I was a child and I'll never forget that. But in between those opportunities, Talking Points is awesome. So I've also given you the web address if you wanna go from your computer to get in. And um, happy connecting.